Hey guys, it's your girl Brianna Queen, and in this video, I'm sharing how I turned this into this. So, you wanna know how? Keep watching. So, I've had this IKEA bookshelf for about eight years now, and it was time for a revamp. So, step one, which is what I always do, is first I thoroughly cleaned the bookshelf. Now, I did have some scratches and scuffs from the mini moves this IKEA bookshelf has went through. So, I took some white paint, just went ahead and painted the shelf just the front so they can be nice and white with no scruffs or chip paint spots. I feel like adding fancy legs to any type of furniture just really elevates it. And I got these legs from Amazon. Originally, it was black. I spray painted it with some gold spray paint. And you guys, all of these products that I use will be listed down below. And I just spray paint them and boom, there you go. Some fancy gold inexpensive legs for my IKEA bookshelf. And this is what the legs look like after applying. Now, obviously, you can leave it just like this, but I'm a little extra, so I did a little extra, okay? I did apply some door inserts that I purchased from Ikea, and y'all, these were so difficult, so complicated. I don't know why Ikea makes their directions so difficult. They were difficult. This was, this was difficult. And I went ahead and got these cute little pull handles from Amazon to really amplify these doors. And one of the best investments I ever made was an electric screwdriver. And this made these doors possible because I was able to really shorten the amount of time it took me to assemble them. I found these gorgeous gold overlays from LuxHacks.com and I just had to have them. Now, fair warning, they are based in Australia, so it did take me two weeks to receive them, but it was totally worth it. So right now I'm going ahead and applying some hot glue to get it to stick. Now some of the overlays do have adhesive on the back, mine did not, maybe because it's metallic, but using some hot glue or some furniture glue and you'll be set. And this is the finished product. Similar items were seven, eight, even a thousand dollars. And I paid less than 350 for this entire project. And it's sturdy and it's cute. I am completely in love with my IKEA bookshelf revamp. What do you guys think? Do you like it? Do you not like it? Let me know down below. If you guys did enjoy this tutorial, be sure to give me a thumbs up as well as share and comment. And don't forget to pin on your Pinterest board. I'll talk to you guys in my very next video. Stay healthy, stay happy, stay beautiful, and stay blessed. I love you. Bye.